Welcome back. This is a lecture that continues from the previous one which talks about Taguchi designs. So as I explained to you the L8 array which is just one array and if you have more factors you could have different arrays. The type of experiments or type of designs within Taguchi are broadly two types. One is called as a static design and another is called as a dynamic design. What is the difference between static and dynamic design? Before I get started, I should tell you that static designs are more popular and from my experience, I've seen a lot of uh, analysis or Taguchi designs which are static. However, dynamic is also equally important and is very powerful. So let me explain to you how they are different and then we'll take a small example and that will make the things a little more clear for you. A static design is one in which you have an output obviously there's a system or a process for which there's an output that's being produced and then you have control factors and noise factors if you remember we talked about the concept of noise earlier anything that is uncontrollable but has an impact on the output is what we call as a noise 